I love everything about Destination Weddings. I love the initial phone call where you hear the excitement in the bride and groom's voice that they have no idea where they want to start and you get to walk them through the process. I enjoy getting with the bride and seeing how excited she is about planning every little thing, detailed from flower petals to napkins to um, her dress and the decor and the, the, the food, the, the music, and just to see them bring their dream into light. And you can just see them, you know, each step you go, it's like they're getting more and more excited about their day. And then when you get to the destination wedding and they actually see it, you know, after we've been talking about it, say for a year, the smile on their face or the tears that they have, it's, it's, it's very rewarding to know that all the work was done for them for just that moment, so yes. My name is Leslie Sickler. I am a travel agent for Dreams and Destinations Travel out of Ashburn, Virginia. So my name is Stacy, and I'm a travel agent and I specialize in destination weddings. Well, my name is Anna Crawford. Um, I'm from Charlotte, North Carolina, and I work for Dreams and Destinations Travel. Okay, my name is Mandy Zitnick, and I am a full-time travel consultant. I'm Renee Wallace, also known as Peaches, my nickname since I was born. My name is Ruby the Side Jones and I'm a destination wedding planner with Dreams and Destinations. I'm a new mom and I love my team that I work with. Hi, I'm Melinda Webb Huggin. I'm president of Dreams and Destinations Travel. We're a full service travel agency that specializes in sending people on wonderful vacations, honeymoons, and destination weddings for 19 years now. Honeymoon is where you get to reconnect and rediscover why you fell in love in the first place and why you want to spend um, the rest of your life together. And so it's really special to have that chance to help plan that important first vacation and that reconnecting time after such a busy event like a wedding. Um, so I feel like I love working with the people because I get to make their dreams come to life and what they envision for one of the most important days of their life. I would say the trending destinations for honeymoons right now would be the Southern Caribbean. I find that a lot of bride and grooms want something different. They want something that they, when they say this destination to their friends, they're like, wow, I've never been there before. I would say Mexico is always a big destination for honeymoons. Um, a lot of people like South Pacific because of the over the water bungalows in Bora Bora. Um, I would say Barbados, um, Jamaica, and I think a little bit here recently has been more so Grenada. People that wanted to go to Japan, to Bali, um, Greece, it seems like they're, they're wanting to go, you know, further than, than just the Caribbean. St. Lucia is very popular for honeymoons right now. Um, also, I'm, I tend to see my clients going more of bucket list destinations for honeymoons, places like Bora Bora, Hawaii, um, Barbados, places that are destinations that are not probably going to be frequented as often as you start your life together. So, um, but St. Lucia is probably number one for me right now. My best advice for couples planning a destination wedding is first and foremost, I would reach out to the people that you definitely want to have to make sure that they can swing it financially. Second, I would reach out to a destination wedding travel consultant before you ever reach out to a resort because we can work as a good intermediary between yourself and the resort because there's a few different ways that you can book a destination wedding and we know how to make it happen for you seamlessly. Enjoy every second. Um, get a destination wedding planner. Um, I think that helps a lot with relieving the stress and anxiety that comes with planning, um, especially if you're busy working, um, just busy with life. I think that you need to just sort of approach it with flexibility um, and allow yourself uh, some planning time. So we're finding more and more couples are booking destination weddings uh, because they're able to have really spectacular weddings at sometimes a price point that is much lower than the average wedding in the U.S.
Mary's Tips for Newlyweds. For the gentlemen, listen to your wife. They know what's right. Happy wife, happy life, absolutely. Travel together, have fun, give yourself a fun money budget. Ours is $500 and we don't have to ask permission to spend that money. Never go to bed without saying I love you. Don't go to sleep in a fight. I'm basically a newlywed, um, two years in. Um, have fun, life, don't take life seriously. You're married to your best friend. Um, life's, I mean, yeah, just have fun with it. Travel, spend time together, disconnect yourself from the busyness of everyday life. Um, and really just make time for each other. To listen to each other. Don't just hear each other, just really listen. And for me it's hard because I'm so busy to just slow down and stop and just take that break and make sure that your husband or your wife knows that they're at that moment the most important thing and just listen. Always be patient. Um, always remember the reason why you got to this point. You're gonna have good days, you're gonna have bad days, but you love that person for a reason. And just remember the love and what brought you to that point and carry you forward. My name is Claudia Solis, Weddings Manager at the new Dreams Vista Cancun. I've worked with uh, Dreams and Destinations for about uh, more than two years, actually. I was at the Dreams Play of Mujeres and Secrets Play of Mujeres uh, when I met Melinda and uh, her team. So, and it's been a great pleasure working with them. My name is Daniela Castillo. I am the weddings manager at Dreams and Secrets by Mujeres, and I'm very happy to uh, have a team of four wedding coordinators. I think it's very important that, uh, or the most important thing, is that they know the destination, they know their couples, they know the way how we work. So they really help us a lot when brides get a little anxious and they don't hear from us in a couple of days, for example. They know our wedding packages, so they are able to answer a lot of the questions instead of waiting for us to, to reply. And I think it's very important for our wedding couples to have someone uh, that they trust and they, are, they offer a very personalized service. So it's uh, very good to work with them because we work as a team. Actually, the service that they offer, it's very unique because uh, Usually travel agents, they just do the rooms and they just reserve the wedding date with the resort and that's it. But Dreams and Destination, they um, offer a personalized service because they help the wedding couple through the entire process from the beginning when they make the, uh, well, actually when they pick the resort and until the very end of the event. You always uh, have someone there from during some destinations helping with the, with all the wedding details, planning, decor, flowers, logistics. So it's very good to, to have that service for wedding couples, especially for a destination wedding. So I think the thing that makes working with Dreams and Destinations Travel so special for your destination wedding or even your honeymoon is that we really have an insider understanding of the process, not just because we work with so many um, brides and grooms and we do so many weddings a year, but out of our team, four of us actually were destination wedding brides. So we've been in the shoes of the destination wedding bride where you're trying to find the perfect location and you really want to get it right for your guests. and sort of the frustration of you know trying to plan from a distance you know the most important event of your life and the one that everybody is going to be talking about for years to come so we get that and we bring just a different perspective in the fact that we um, are very familiar with the process from personal perspective the fun part is figuring out what your vision is for that wedding and then watching it come to life and so we're able to extend that planning process to where it doesn't feel so rushed and to where you can really enjoy it um, and then act as a liaison. For honeymoons, I think more often than not you're going to find us living vicariously through your experience. What we're planning for you would be exactly what we would do for ourselves if we were going to be on that same trip together and then tweaking it to where it matches your personalities perfectly. Um, so we don't just plan travel, we're passionate about travel. Our whole team um, start to finish is just that we this is what we do, this is what we love. None of us can imagine doing anything else. And that translates time and time and time again into amazing destination experiences for our clients.